and they're off. No Hang Charlie is sent out for the lead and the favorite Impossible Task is also hustled pretty hard in the early stages to engage. Then it's Doc Adams, a close up third and in between those two, followed by Absolute Unit in fourth and Rifey, who was off a step slowly, is at the back of the field. Heading to the sixth furlong pole, No Hang Charlie has the lead, three quarters of a length with Impossible Task up alongside second. A length and a half, Doc Adams at the rail, just in front of Absolute Unit, and now just two more back to Rifey. They move on to the back stretch, and it is No Hang Charlie leading the way, but now pressed by Impossible Task, and Impossible Task, Gray Head moves to the front past the 5 8 pole. A length and a half behind them to Absolute Unit in third. At the rail, it's Doc Adams in fourth, about two and a half or three off the lead now, and Rifey starts to move up willingly outside of that pair. It's Impossible Task and No Hang Charlie. Absolute Unit makes a three-wide bid after them and takes second around the far turn. Rifey moves into fourth. Doc Adams now trails. They have a quarter of a mile to go, and Absolute Unit is the new leader narrowly. Between horses, Impossible Task all out trying to go with them. These two are head and head, and at the rail, No Hang Charlie there, joined four wide by Rifey. Impossible Task now turns away Absolute Unit. Fresh challenge coming from Rifey on the outside. Impossible Task, Rifey a length and a half back and closing. Impossible Task holding on late. It's Impossible Task. He earned the victory. Wins by three quarters. Rifey second, then No Hang Charlie and Doc Adams. 